So, hello guys and welcome to the next episode on my channel. So today we're going to be playing more of Pokemon Brick Bronze. And in today's episode we will actually uh, explore Mount Iginius, not like the title suggested of the last episode. That was a bad joke, I didn't, I didn't even know why I did it. So before we go through um, this mountain here, let's take a look at our team. As you can see, I did some off-screen grinding to, uh, and grinded up everyone to at least level 17. So we have Buggy Deningada level 17 with the Compound Ice ability, Hardy Nature with the Moose, Sand Attack, Mud Slap, Leech Life and Cut. And you may notice that some Pokemon learned some new moves when, uh, when I grinded up to them. So Ninkada learned Mud Slap. Uh, at level 17. We have Eevee level 17 as well. Quirky Nature, Adaptability Ability, Baby Doll Eyes, Tackle, Bite and Sand Attack. Eevee and Bite at 17 I think too. Nightcrow the Murkrow level 18 with the Docile Nature, Super Lockability, with the moves Wing Attack, Astonish Pursuit and Haze. I think Nightcrow learned Wing Attack. We have Firium, the Lead Leon, level 17, Rivalry Ability, Lex, Na Lex Natural, with the moves Headbutt, Noble Roar, Ember and Warcup. Noble, uh, Firium learned Noble Roar, I think. We have Stinky the Stunky, level uh, 17, Stench Ability, Naive Nature, with the moves Scratch, Focus, Energy, Poison Gas and Small Screen. And uh, Crocona our starter level 20 with the hasty uh, nature torrent ability with the moves scratch, power up punch, water gun and bite. So that's the team we're going to lead with Buggy and our encounter is a Torco. Okay. Interesting. So I and when I went back and uh, I bought, bought some repels so we can get through this cave easily. Mm. Yeah, and that's really it. It and bought some pokeballs as well. And that's it, uh, except for the training, of, of course. So I think in the next episode, episode we are going to we will be battling the gym leader. So. I'm going to do some of screen grinding after this episode as well. So yeah. That cry that Torkoal has just is just hilarious. Uh, I mean Torkoal isn't anything very special and why can't I catch it? I don't want power up and because it will kill. Okay, uh, let's switch to Firion and Ember and I hope that doesn't kill. He raised his defense, okay. Ember. Okay, it didn't kill. Mm -hmm. Let's throw a Great Bull now. I can use the dust ball, but I don't want to really wait to waste it. Yeah, we caught it, so that's that's good. Yeah, uh, let's name it Fire Turtle. I'm bad at <laughs> giving nicknames. I told that so many times. And so much experience after that. Let's read his Pokedex entry. He's a virgin Poke. I, I I didn't read Croconus is entry. So let's read it now. Once Crocona has clapped, clamped its jaws and its foe, it will absolutely not let go, because the tips of its fangs are forked back like barbed fish hooks. They become impossible to remove when they have sunk in. Wow. Torkoal here. Torkoal digs through mountains in search of coal. If it finds some, it fills hollow spaces on its shell with the coal and burns it. 
If it's attack, this Pokemon spouts thick black smoke to beat a retreat. Okay. Now let's spray that repel that I bought. Use. Okay. Um, and here's the Team Eclipse member. Hey, how, how did you get past the guard outside? You know it really doesn't surprise me. He was weak in my opinion. You will not beat me though. Grant, Grant Mason, a slugma. Mm, slugma. Uh, Eevee. Let's let's go to Eevee because I know that uh, tackle. I know that uh, Crocon is super effective, but. But uh, he has he's level 20 and the level limit is 25 and I need him for the gym leader so I don't want to really use it or use him and I'm going to die in a second I didn't buy any burn hills because I'm so smart. We're going through a volcano. Didn't buy burn hills. Seems like a good idea. It didn't even kill, really. Let's tackle it again. Now it kills. I need to train a buggy because his growth rate is erratic, literally, so... Let's heal up Eevee, so it's... I can't heal it burn, unfortunately, but... Yeah, we're just gonna have to deal with it. Another Team Eclipse member. I was told to wait here and escort our any intruders. If you won't leave on your own, then I will have to force you out after I beat you in a battle. Okay. In today's episode, we will be banging a lot of Team Eclipse members, so... Yeah. Zubat. We don't have anything on Ninkaya to deal with that. Let's see... Nightcrow. Yeah, Nightcrow is like my ultimate Zubat uh, counter because only uh, wing attack does, uh, isn't resisted by Murkrow, so... Uh, let's astonish, because why not? Buggy won't level up in a long time. Drymer, only a. F Let's send out Firion. I think I, I don't have uh, antidotes as well, I think. Let's check. No, I have paralyzed heals. Really? Ever. That does almost nothing. It's going to be like 5 hit KO, maybe. Or even more. You can harden all day. Ember is a special attack. Two hits, I think, left. Or maybe even more. Let's switch. Let's switch to Buggy because he resisted. I, I think times four. Um, no, but doesn't resist poison. I forgot. Forget. We had ground. Oh my god! I forgot. <laughs> well, that's okay. We beat it. We beat the Grimer anyway. Farin levels up. Level 18. That's good. I don't think the potions will be enough. 
to go through this through the whole cave. What's in there? I think the yeah, that's the path to Ignis Depths when you can uh, find um, find Heatran. I think it seems like the chamber is dead is a dead end. Since we both here, would you mind having a battle? Yes, I would. Hiker Darrell as another slugma. <sighs> mm, I didn't mean to run. Let's mount slap. Let's see how much this does. A four hit KO, I think, and we're lowering it, lowering its accuracy. So that so I think it will all stay in. Oh, a crit! Nice. Harden. <laughs> Let's cut this thing now. It will be enough here. Yeah. Another normal. I will switch in, sw uh, switch to to Crocona because for yeah I know I know I said I don't want to use Crocona really but four times a week to water so yeah. <laughs> okay. Slugma. Let's switch to buggy again. <laughs> Only three levels uh, and N Ninkada will evolve. Or maybe won't evolve. You will have to see what I mean uh, when it reaches level of evolution. Let's mouse lap again. Oh my god. No! No! Ninkada, why? Why does why did it did so much? Why did it do so much? Why? Oh my god. I will have to train that Raihorn in the PC or the Torku, but I have already have a fire type so. You know what? I'm going to run back. Uh, no, to um, to the Pokemon Center, so I can put uh, Ninkada in the PC and buy some more potions and burn he burn heals. So I'm gonna be right back. Okay, so I'm back. And unfortunately, I will have to put uh, Ninkada in the, PC, P, the in the dev box. He will be missed, Ninkada. Man, we have we have two back types in the P, in the dev box. Um, let's take a look at the historical that I catched. Uh, Calm nature, white smoke ability. Uh, Higher attacks, lower special defense, with the moves, ember smog, and withdraw. Okay, but I think uh, we will we will put uh, Raihorn on the team. Uh, I will heal up, and I bought some potions already, but I don't have any money to buy a single burn healer. So uh, we're just going to have. We ha we will have to deal with about burn hills, so I will I will see you when I'm back uh, at the Mount Iginius. Okay, so I'm back and uh, let's battle this Team Eclipse guy. Team Eclipse will achieve its goal. We'll not allow a breath like you to get in our way. Prepare to be driven out. I'm pre driven out of what? The, of this volcano? Okay. Ekans. Uh, let's switch to Stan Stinky. So unfortunately, uh, Raihorn is level uh, 
11 and you can find 11, level 11 uh, Pokemon in this volcano in this mount in this mountain so unfortunately we will be running into wild Pokemon but it when we le when the uh, Raihorn levels up a level it shouldn't be the case anymore so that's okay. This uh, this Ekans, uh, if it's go, uh, no, we didn't uh, kill it. But Ekans flinch because we have the stench ability, so we kill it anyway. Raihorn gained so experience. I want to switch up, switch train Raihorn. And I'm going to train everybody off screen for the gym leader anyway, so our plan is almost in effect now. I'm afraid you will miss the show after I beat you in battle. I don't think so, Louis. I think it's pronounced. Mm, let's switch to Crocona because once again four times effective effective while we're on on the normal <laughs> it should be one hit KO it is so yeah that's good Crocona almost level 21 let's switch to Raihan and then back to mm, Crocodile Level 15 level I think this is um, the last uh, ground battle Oh my god really? Really? Cro on Crocodile the most important person in my team maybe, no, maybe not person but You know what I mean Crocodile Level 21? Yeah. And Ice Fang. Sure, I'm going to learn it. Uh, get rid of that scratch because it's kinda useless. Ice Fang. That's a good coverage move. So that burn is annoying though. Zubat. Let's switch to Raihorn. I think Raihorn can handle this. Let's see what level it is. 15. Let's run attack and see how much it does. Of course we flinch, of course. <laughs> Horn attack, how much it does. Uh, I'm not going to switch it. I'm not going to stay in. <laughs> We're going to switch to Nightcrow. Super Sonic. Really? Is it really necessary? Let's wing attack and hope that it doesn't hit yourself. Nightcrow, don't hit yourself or you will get bodied by that by a Zuba. Do you really want that? Okay. So I think Nightcrow doesn't want to get bodied by a Zubat. That's good actually. Well maybe you will get to witness our plan in action after all. Maybe I will. Let's heal. Use. Let's use some Crocona. And then Super Potion Wasting. Uh, right hand want a uh, battle anyway, so yeah, use another one. Oh, hello there! You are just in time for the show. What's this? You want your parents to be set free? You must be the child of those two archaeologists we abducted back in Metis Town. Your parents have been rather difficult to work with. They were not cooperative at first. It wasn't until after we threatened to harm their family that they gave in to our requests. 
They must have been afraid for you. They have every right to be. I'm afraid if you're here to stop us, then you're then you are too late. According to the legend, I need only lay this orb on the pedestal behind me toward in order to awaken a powerful sleeping Pokemon. Why awaken such a beast, you ask? That's for us to know. I'm afraid you will not be privileged to find out the purposes or to our action at this time. I grow weary of speaking to you, child. It is time for me to carry out our plan. What? You won't allow that? You fear for the town's safety, do you? Well, if you are only here to get in my way, then I'm afraid that the only way to be rid, to be rid of you is with a Pokemon battle. I warn you though, I'm one of the team that leaps mad means I will not be defeated. <coughs> That hurt my voice a little bit. A homage. Okay, that music though. Let's. Oh my god! He caught me off guard. I thought Rihon will be dead, really, for a second. Okay, how much goes down? That's good. Vulabai. Charian mm. can stay in. Let's Amber. This fight might be difficult, uh, depends on what his final Pokemon is. Let's Ember, Vulabai goes, goes down, Farian levels up, and Lunatone. Let's switch to Eevee because Eevee has Bite. Rock polish. That's not good. That bite. Embargo. Uh oh. That's a four hit KO. Another embargo. He derped. He he don't goofed. No, and again he don't goofed. And we beat the Lana Town, so we beat, we beat this admin, I think. Or maybe he has Soul Rock as well. No, he doesn't. You little twerp. I forgot his voice already. Well, it seems you are quite strong for such a new trainer. No matter, I have come here to carry out a very important task. I will not let my leader down. Prepare yourself for the awesome power within this volcano. What's happening? I actually know what's happening, but... Unfortunate that we won't ca uh, be able to catch it actually... Mm -mm. Yeah. Groudon, the giant sleeping within this volcano has now awoken! With this power, Team Eclipse will more, will more fully be capable of carrying out its purposes. Fear this mighty Pokemon, foolish child, as I now manipulate Groudon to do our bidding. Groudon, it was I who woke you from your slumber. You will now help Team Eclipse fulf uh, fulfill its purpose. I command you now, Groudon, to follow my exact orders. I think that means no. Everybody run! Forgot his voice. I have to grab the rod or red or quick before the ground gets out of control. I forgot everyone's voices. 
Groudon, please forgive us for distur disturbing your rest. We promise that we won't disturb you again. There is a village right outside this volcano with, with a lot of good people in it. If this volcano erupts, it could destroy the entire village and hurt many innocent people. Please active, accept this apology and we will be on our way. <coughs> okay. We get rid of the Groudon. I'm actually kind of surprised Groudon, Groudon let us go that easily. For a second there I thought might... Uh, for a second there I thought might have been toast. What? Did you see the way Groudon was looking at you though? It was as if he saw something in you. Maybe that's why he just left like that. I have a feeling that we might see Groudon again someday. Either way, you did a good job showing Team Eclipse who's boss. I can't let everyone back in town. I can let everyone back in town now that their homes are safe. Hey, you should st you should stop by my gym. I'd love to see firsthand how strong of a trainer you are. All right, all right. I will, well, I better get going. I will be seeing you soon, hopefully. So let's get. Uh, Let's leave this volcano and I will end the episode when <coughs> repulse effect were off. <coughs> Let's use another one. So I'm going to end the episode here, hope you guys enjoyed, if you did click the like button and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this and I will see you in the next episode, bye!